So that certain Aquaman starlet loses big. Some familiar words are repeated by a judge. Denied, denied, denied. Oh, man. So, hey there to all you fine folks on this fine day, by the way. I hope you were doing excellently. And the desperation, oh, it is something to watch. As April 11th, 2022 draws near, that is when JD versus that certain Aquaman Starlet are going to face off. And that certain Aquaman Starlet, well, they are trying anything they can, and they keep getting shut down repeatedly. Now, we'll talk about that decision in just a moment, but even more telling than the decision itself is what's being requested. Why? Because you can tell that certain Aquaman Starlet is a afraid, you know they had things pop up in the UK 2020 that they weren't expecting, things that basically took narratives apart, and they want any of that stuff revealed now. You can see that right here. Revised request number 38. You need to turn over any video recordings, audio recordings, photographs, images of that certain Aquaman starlet, including any copies of anything recorded by JD or any of his entities, representatives, or agents from January the 1st, 2012 to the present. Now, as far as the decisions are concerned, many of these things have actually been looked at before. You've actually had some of them turned down. You've had revisions to the request. And the interesting thing is that when something actually goes that certain Aquaman starlet's way, you don't only see what they want to do, but you see what they're locked into. For example, right here, here's something that goes their way. Order that as to the following request for that certain Aquaman Starlet's request for production of documents. JD shall produce any non-privileged documents. You always take that into consideration. Non-privileged within his possession, custody, or control responsive to the following revised request. So request number one here. And they all come from the same audio recording exhibit. So I'm not going to read this. Let's just say documents related to any of these statements here. So the first statement. I have gotten emails from every bleeping studio, bleeping head, from every bleeper. I didn't do a thing. I'm sorry you're going through this. I'm so sorry. Clearly, she's out of her bleeping mind. She is viewed as out of her bleeping mind across the globe. So, she wants proof that people made those statements to JD. What do you think is going to happen with that? Well, number one, we're going to see the same thing that we saw with Warner Brothers. She's going to try to ensure sure that she is unfireable or unassailable in her position. And number two, there's going to be retaliation. You mark my words, if any place gets named, you know how that shield media is going to come up. Oh, this place, they actually encourage DV. You mark my words, that's what you would see. So revise request number two. Again, not going to read all of the document getting there, but they want anything that says that it backs up. There ain't no bleeper in this business that's going to hire her. And then for requires request number three, oh, she's ruined for sure. She did that to herself. In terms of business, she's a rap. So when you see that there again, what do you think she's trying to do? She's trying to say, he damaged me. He's trying to ruin me. But at the same time, again, pointing at those companies saying they they were down with this. And well, they were down with it big time. Now that vindictiveness, it continues by the way, because that, that is that certain Aquaman Starlet's plan. They hope to ride this to a hundred million dollar decision. You know, JD, he asked for fifty million dollars in damages, so of course they had to ask for a hundred million dollars in damages. And one of the ways that they're trying to do this is to blame JD for anything that Adam Waldman has done. Now first and foremost, I don't think Adam Waldman has done anything wrong. He basically, he corrected this public mentality that certain Aquaman Starlet produced, saying that JD, well, you know what she said about him. 2018 forward, you see that change? I think Adam Waldman, he did that. So, of course, you see them trying to connect it to, again, saying, 
He did this because J.D. told him to. So revised request number two. This is ordered to be produced. Please produce any documents or communications supporting the following statement from J.D.'s fourth defense to the counterclaim. The statements forming the basis of the counterclaim, they were not made by the counterclaim defendant, a.k.a. Everything that you're trying to say that I did to you, I didn't say any of that stuff at all. Adam Waldman said it, and I imagine Adam Waldman set the record straight when he was deposed, by the way, and I get the feeling that that deposition, it went incredibly well, but that, that's another video. Now this here requires request number three through number seven, so please produce any documents or communications supporting the following statements from J.D.'s fifth defense to the counterclaim, whether or not there was authorization from the counterclaim defendant to, or a conspiracy with Adam Waldman to make statements forming the basis of the counterclaim. So there was claiming that behind the scenes there was this conspiracy. It's a vast conspiracy by the way. It involves hundreds and hundreds of Twitter accounts, but hey, don't include that in there. Just talk about JD and Adam Waldman because that doesn't sound so crazy, does it? Part B here, counterclaim defendants lack of direction as to the subject statements. Number C, counterclaim defendants lack of direction or control of a third party as to the subject statements. And that's true, by the way. Like if I want to talk about something, even if I worked with somebody, can you really control what I want to say on that? No, you're not going to muzzle me. You're not going to tell me not to talk about something like proof that says that this guy should be redeemed when he hasn't done anything wrong. You're not going to stop me. He doesn't have to ask me to do that because I would, and I imagine that's what Adam Waldman thought too. D, the third party exceeded the scope of employment or agency relationship as to the subject statements, and the statements were made by an independent contractor. Again, I didn't have to tell him to do that. You know, when I hired him, I hired him for A, B, and C. He went out, he did D on his own. Yeah, what am I supposed to do about that? And I wouldn't want to do anything at all, and I don't think JD does either. Now, the reason that this is such a big loss is because those two things, revised request number 38 and a few other revised requests, ones that deal with alcohol and let's just say any substances on dates of allegations, any property damage done by JD, and do you have any proof that the negative impact of the divorce action, UK action, or those allegations, they ended up damaging your career or your reputation. Those are the things that that certain Aquaman starlet actually had handed over to them, and they asked for everything under the sun. Again, they're going to be stuck with this. They're going to be stuck with Tracy Jacobs. That's going to be his ex-agent. And they're going to be stuck with the whataboutism. That's going to be the entirety of their case going forward. It's going to be something to watch, too. Them trying to say the same things when basically you had a trial run at this in the UK 2020 you have JD's team knowing exactly what they're going to do like I said big big losses because this kind of stuff right here it's already been decided on before they just wanted to reword it double and triple down yeah you got what you asked for and well you didn't get a lot when you were asking for it but anyway let me know what you think about this stuff and as always appreciate the heck out of you you make this stuff work Thank you. Appreciate that sincerely. Want to help out the channel in different ways? There are links in the description. We could always use your help with that, so check those out. But you being here, that matters most, so thank you. Going to end here with that, too. Thank you again, and we will see you soon.